Hey everybody, welcome back to the Golden Goblet, Day 9. Any StarCraft fans here? What do you mean you've never heard of it? Doesn't, doesn't make sense. Today we're playing Valle de los Reyes, which uh, clearly my Spanish is not so good. Valle de los Reyes, there you go. Um, I, I don't know anything about this, uh, this course, but we'll be playing the front nine. And yesterday we put down a very solid um, minus five, five under I should say, which is uh, with our handicap took us to minus seven, which is Welcome just outrageous. Let's see if we can keep it up. We are at Valle de los Reyes and uh, a beautiful design by Antonio Scarpacci. Oh. I think we have a few of his courses in our game now. And, uh, what do you mean in our game? I'm golfing. Beauty. We are in Spain. Oh. So let's have a good one out there. Let's do it. All right, let's do it, John. I got to be honest, brother. These are tight fairways. You got me a little spooked, but we're going to try this right here. Um, we're going to adjust it just slightly. Solid Beautiful. Swing. Beautiful up and down swing. Just hoping that tree doesn't block us from uh, our approach, but I think it might because of the, the downward slope of the fairway here, but it is what it is. We can try to loft it over that. I think that's that's okay right now. You are 10 feet up. So I think you do look to this like the 9-iron is, is quite potent. Now, don't hit the tree. I heard some leaves. But it's not that bad. It's not that bad. I'm not right all the time, but uh, I definitely was this time. Pretty Con deep stuff here. Congratulations, John. I'm uh, happy for you. Hack. Let's put it in the right direction. All right. So this one is real tricky. Pitching wedge flop is not going to get us as far as I would like to go. But a nine iron pitch is truly horrible. <laughs> oh, this is... This is one of those awkward shots. We don't really have a good bead on anything. Yeah, nothing's great. I think you might look at this as a... Oh my god, look at the lob wedge pitch. No, it's that's pretty generous. So, we just want to hit this. Being at full wouldn't be too bad, because we're 62 to 69% in the green to begin with. Or in the rough to begin with. Shooting a little bit over that way. But we want to be maybe like 80%. Or 90 is okay. I can live with it. Clearly still way off. Because uh, I do not see the, the hole. <laughs> I think this is a chip opportunity for me. This is I look to this as a, a chip. It's the chip of the century. Get ready. That's not bad. Is it better than a putt would have been? Debatable. Nice putt. We're in the hole. Good stuff. So I think we're a plus one. That hurts. Because that was like a pretty... I mean, the drive was great except for the tree. Everything else got a little, got a little screwed. Like, what, what are you doing with these trees, dude? Do you think it's funny to, to put trees in the way on the, on the course? Do you think that's humorous? Because it's, like, it's a little funny, but it's not that funny. So I think we're going to go... This is a real weird one, but I think we're going to start with a three wood. Nice. And you just want to land close to the center of the fairway as possible because I didn't realize we were hitting inside of a... You know, a, a rainforest, even though it is quite dry. <laughs> Truth be told. Um, you know, we want to, if possible, if there's no trees in our way right here, something like this would be okay. Now that was a swing. Oh, sorry, Kate's playing Mahjong in the background. It's getting, it's getting heated up there. Okay. So this is like, we're not getting an eagle chance, which feels bad, but... That's okay. So it's 10 feet up, and this is an 8-iron pitch. I think we can live with this. 
I think we can live with this performance. We're going to be way off, dude. But that's that's sinkable. Sweet. That's a sinkable okay, 11 putt. Footer here. This 11 footer. Man. We weren't as off as I thought we were actually. So let's let's look at this. This is like it's close to even. I think we need a little left. But not much, honestly. Ooh. Straight on would have done it. Straight on would have taken us in. This is a tough course. This is not Solid like well <laughs> Atlantic played. Beach Country Club. This is and some this is some real stuff. Hold on, are we hitting we're hitting from the white tees? I was wondering because this seems like the We're so far back compared to usual. I think I'm hitting from the wrong tee. No, I mean these are the closest. White, yeah. Maybe they only have white tees on this one. Um, of the plain variety. Get it? Oh, it's what you do to me. Oh, it's what you do to me. Okay. So you're looking at this and you're saying the wind's going to put you in the sand trap. But I don't think that's true. I think what I want to avoid is landing on the right side of the fairway and then taking that slope into the, into the tall grass, right? I think being right about here... It's going to be okay. And if I'm wrong, I'm wrong. That was only 95%. But uh, it was a drive, so that's okay. We can okay, live with that. About, uh, 190 yards to go 190 here. yards. I think, you, I think you accept this. It's 13 feet up. Should put you in striking distance. What the heck was that? Oh. It's a beautiful thing. You couldn't ask for a nicer approach than that from that distance, I think. Okay, you're on the green. So this is our birdie putt. Here or we go. Drop this one for birdie. should I say our our birdie chip? <laughs> no, this is a, it's a putt. It's a putt. We definitely need some right lean here, but not too much. I think maybe that'll do. Quite the hill in front of us. Oh. We just needed a little bit more right, power. Nice two foot putt. Dude, this hole well, or this course is so much harder than the one we played yesterday. This is outrageous. One over so we're round. one over still, which hurts. It hurts, but we're going to get there. We're going to get it back. I don't think we've been playing a bad game. This one's 19 feet down. So I think we definitely do want to club down. Question is, do we club down twice? With the wind, I don't think we need the club down two times. But I, I could be wrong. I could be wrong. I'm not an experienced golfer. Let's send it. Oh, a little fast on the backswing, but... Ooh, looking good, looking good. Good carry. Now just die on the green. Oh, that's, that's pretty close. That's pretty, if our swing was a little fat, like it was in the right rhythm, we would have been in a, an even better spot. But this is, uh, this is pretty good. It's pretty good. Awesome. That's a great hole. Played properly, looked at the conditions, the sank the putt, brought us back to even with the nice on five holes hole. yet left to play. In the works here. Wind is, is really holding me back here a little bit, but that's you can't control for that. Oh. Nice swing. Little fast on the backswing. It's like I'm getting a little too eager. But that's a that's a pretty minor thing in the whole scheme. Not going to affect things all that much. All we right, go up to 252. About, uh, Still a long hit to get to the green, dude. Here. And with that being 18 feet up, with 8 mile an hour wind, I agree with the caddy. I think you just send this one. Oh. So good. We even could have adjusted a little more left. Just get me on the green, please. It's close. Very nice. I don't believe it. He actually hit us with a Borat. That's incredible. You know what? You just send this one. Get ready. Wait. Nice little chip in for birdie. That it's, was that was that was a fine shot. Okay, that'll bring it down to. First he said very nice. Then he said I gave him a money nice shot. John. 
Oh, Dude, our short game has gotten so much better. This is this is outrageous. I think we definitely prefer. We might even prefer the five wood, but then that'll give us a two hundred and fifty yard shot to make to get on the green in two, which is gonna be really hard. It's gonna be really hard no matter what. But great contact. The strokes are just out of control. And it's just beautiful watching this little ball fly through the air on a beautiful day in the most arid climate on planet Earth, Looks apparently. Like about 205 yards. 205 yards. Oh, it's definitely makeable. There is a tree in the middle, but we're going to be over that. It's one foot up. Yeah, this is, this is a... I think it's a five hybrid situation. Screwed it up a little, but don't think we're going to be in the sand. I think we're going to bounce nicely. And we can get another chip. This is a chip for Eagle, which is very exciting. We want to actually this time be a little bit off to the right because of the lie of the green. There, what can you say? Nice. What can you say? The man is, his short game is nuts. It's out of control. Birdie, birdie, eagle. Par four here. Let's have a nice, clean drive. He's pogging up. You can say it. I'll allow you to say it. You have my permission. He's pogging up. So I think here, just putting us like right here seems good to me. Miss the tree and hopefully have enough carry to get to the right of the other tree. Oh. Clear your mind. Just a beautiful... Beautiful approach. We are bang on with that tree. That's unfortunate. Sweet. And we have about, I'd say, 140-ish yards from here. So this is a huge, like, fission mailed moment. But with strong wind, this might take us around, but it's going to have to get, like, way up there. I'm like, just give it a little bit more loft, even. <laughs> and we're going to be, yeah, prefer this because we're lying a little bit to the left. Get it over that tree, dude. This would be the shot of the century if it makes it on the green. It went over the tree. It's going to the right. Let's call it. Shot of the century. That might be a little ambitious. But a really, really nice approach for sure. Okay, this is, this is puttable. This is where you lose it, so just shake out your shoulders a little bit. It's only 14 feet away. Didn't quite get enough on it, but that's okay. It was it was in the All ballpark. Right, next for the par. We should really just start chipping on the green. Apparently that, <laughs> even from 10 feet away, we should be doing 10 foot chips. The They're straight as an arrow, and the the roll of the green doesn't affect and us. We find ourselves on the eighth. You may tee. find yourself on the eighth tee. Three feet up. Ten mile an hour wind. Dude, this is a spicy one. But, you know, who dares wins? You always got to go for the hole in one. Beautiful. Make it over the sand. Solid approach. We get two putt from here. You could say that again, John. Nothing too scary. A six footer. Nothing too scary. Clearly, you didn't play on my middle school basketball team. Drained it. Nicely done. Drop Thank it you, John. That, that was another That's extraordinarily well-played hole. <laughs> All right, four under on a and long par four. Coming up. Interesting. Interesting. I think we'd rather... We'd rather be around here, but it's a spicier shot. This is a little safer, so I think we'll take the safer approach. Doesn't move the needle too much in either direction. Let's just double-check, make sure we're not... Yeah, I think this is a little smarter. <laughs> wow. Uh, shot. It's going to be fine, but what happened on that stroke? Okay, we're not hitting the trees. It still is completely okay, okay but that, that stroke was uh, uncomfortable looking. Ten feet up. 
I still... Oh. <laughs> 10 feet up, huh? 10 feet up. A par four. This is a spicy one. You'd really like to... <sighs> I think you gotta do it like this. And let's try to lower the loft. Oh my. But a lower loft will travel farther and be less affected by the wind. It'll land a little faster. I, actually, I think I'm dumb. On this one, I think we would rather a higher loft. Bring me a higher loft. That way, it uh, makes it onto the green. It's going to spend a little bit more time in the air. Or a lot more time in the air. Yeah, we probably even want to go like here. This is a tough one, though. This is anytime you have to hit in between clubs, that's that's where things are going to be a little tighter. But I can't really be displeased with that. I knew we were going to have a long, nice. a long shot here All for right, the birdie. For the birdie. Uh, I'll tell you right off the bat, this is a it's a chip situation. <laughs> and let's see which way the green's rolling. Very heavily to the left. Okay, you ready? Way too much power. Okay, that's a we're about that's a putt here. situation. <laughs> so let's let's not make the same mistake again. Seventeen feet, but it's going down. Oh my! Oh man! Oh my! Oh my! Don't let it squander it. Yeah, don't let it don't let it ruin you. It is what it is. If you double bogue this hole, you double bogue this hole. We still had a great time. Ooh. Now that's the worst way to miss a putt, John, you got to right, admit. This hole and we'll head to the clubhouse. All right, we're heading to the there clubhouse, we go. John. Nice, easy one to finish off the round. We did get a double bogey. We finished at a minus yeah, 2. Good job out there. But a very good strong good. minus 2, which moves to minus 4. With the um, with the handicap. So I'm feeling pretty okay about that. I thought that was pretty good for now. Thanks for watching. I hope you guys have enjoyed this. If you did, please do click the like button. It helps out a great deal. And subscribe if you want to see more in the future. Go watch Dan and Mouse Perspectives. These are easy, breezy, beautiful videos where you can see all three. And go to goldengoblet.net to see how everybody's doing. For now, thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. See ya!